So in this video, let me show you how to set up uh, Selenium environment. For that, we need a Java compiler and runtime. So instead of using uh, Oracle JDK, I will use Adapt Token JDK. So which is an open source version instead of uh, purchasing license from Oracle. Adopt open JDK. Let me pick the so before picking any version, let me go to selenium hq.org. So it will let's go to selenium web driver and see the latest uh, version available supported minimum supported version is yet so uh, we can go with 16 that is also fine let's go with the latest one and click on download operating system I will select Windows 64 bit. Click on open file. Either you can install the MSI. Uh, when you are installing the MSI, just select this one. So it will automatically set the environment variable. And if you select this one, uh, uh, it will install the file associations related to JNLP and all those files. Click next and click install. If you uh, just download the zip version, extract in any folder and set the environment variable java underscore home. So as I installed directly, if you go to the properties and environment system variables you see java underscore home got set and the same java underscore home bin folder uh, is set to path variable also so this particular folder uh, is set as uh, Let me close this prompts. This is Java underscore home, and this bin folder says it's set to path variable so that uh, I will be accessing this Java, Java C, all these files executables directly. So now, along with that, let me download Eclipse. Go to downloads in Eclipse. Download a minimum version uh, which contains um, Maven. Eclipse packages. So just click on this download packages instead of complete one. java web developers we don't need that much the first one you see it's a minimum one which with just uh, java ide xml editor maven and gradle integration this is enough for us click on this x64 click on download it's downloaded a zip file let me open this and let me install 7-zip, it should be useful. Uh, yeah. So installed and uh, let 
let me extract this seven so lift extract here instead of keeping in downloads what i will do is i will keep in some uh, c drive and direct the c so this eclipse uh, i will click on send to desktop create shortcut so it will create a shortcut on desktop it doesn't need to install maven separately because it comes by default in build in eclipse so first time it will take some time to load so because it should uh, do some initial configurations wait for the program to respond so you can select any of the folder but let me select the default one okay so all your projects will be there in that workspace whichever you create for new So for testing purpose, uh, let me just uh, create a Java project and uh, environment uh, if you observe it picked automatically Java standard edition and uh, no what command prompt Java iPhone iPhone version ours is 16 open JDK. so user runtime java standard edition like that instead you can configure JRS it ripped from that eclipse folder directly instead let me see the contents of it with eclipse itself i got some jra so instead of using this one let me configure my external one so directory Yeah, you see it got directly picked with that environment variable reset so let me select this folder so it is picking that one now so click finish so this got set apply and close Install JRS. So compiler SDK level, it should be 16. Apply and close. So SDK level, I will keep 16. click on uh, project name let me select test project and click next and click finish now to cross check again properties this one yeah so on the source folder uh, uh, just from dummy it is there you can just delete that if you don't want let me new class 
testing class something and uh, better to keep uh, capital letters and let me have a main method and click finish psvm tab public static no no already there system dot out dot println some text so uh, let me click on right click run as java application and you can see the runtime here some test so the execution is working so this is the basic uh, configuration we have done the software to be installed that's it